Now that we've added our text to our button, let's do some navigation. Now we've already done a little bit of navigation inside the button and making it a multi-state button. But what we're gonna do now is take each instance of this button and give it a different type of navigation. We're going to do a URL as well as move inside the movie. Now, before we start doing anything, we still have these very generic names. We have button and we have text. Let's change that. This is going to be our Facebook button. So we can literally go in and either call this simply Facebook or Facebook button. And I also want to come down here and select our text. And let's go over to our properties. And I'm going to simply type in FB underscore text. So now if we look at our layers, everything's set up correct. What we'll do next is go ahead and right click on our Facebook button, come down and open actions for Facebook. And we already have the on rollovers and on mouse downs pretty much built into our button symbol. So I'm just gonna click on click. And what we wanna do is come over here and click open URL. Now by default, this is set up for Adobe, but let's have it go to Facebook. And I'm gonna use Facebook shortcut actually, and just simply type in F and the letter B. And instead of self, I'll make this blank. And let's test out our movie. Let's do command return, control enter on PC. So now if we click on this, it takes us straight to Facebook. Let's go ahead and close these out. And let's create another button. So I'm gonna select all these elements here and hold on my option key, Alt on PC. I'm going to click and drag down a duplicate copy. Let go of the mouse, let go of the keyboard. Now what I'm gonna do next is I'm going to select our button and I don't want this to be called Facebook. Let's say if we're going to do Google. And set that up as well as come down and select our text. Now if you note, I keep running down here to our timeline because it's a lot easier because the text is setting behind the button. So I'm going to right click, edit text. So we'll simply type in Google. And on our layer, we'll simply call this Google. I'm just gonna do G-G-L-T-E-X-T. -E now for this button, we'll right click, come down to open actions for Google. And because we duplicated that initial button, it still has the Facebook URL. So we'll just highlight this, type in Google. And let's test our movie. Command return, control enter on PC. So this should take us to Google. I'm gonna go back here and this should take us still to Facebook. And there we have it. Now, one last thing we wanna do is set up a little navigation for moving inside of the movie. So again, I'll duplicate our button here. I'm just gonna hold on my option key, Alt on PC. And we'll come down to our timeline to Google text copy to select that. I'm gonna right click, edit text, and we'll type in about us. And also change this here. Okay, now what I wanna do is go ahead and set up a about us section on our timeline. So I'm going to get my text tool and type right here. I'll do about us. I'm not worried about placement right now. I just want to use this as an example. We'll click OK. And we have this at the very beginning. I want to set this to off for now. And let's say that at 0.5, we have that on. And in addition to that, we're going to add a label. So let's do Command L. And we'll say, we'll call that about us. All right, so we'll go back to the beginning here. We'll select our new About Us button, right click, come down and open Actions for About Us. And instead of us going to our URL for Google, we're gonna come here, I'm just gonna delete this. And I want to use Stop At, and instead of us going to a time, like one second in, we're going to simply type in, let's do quote, unquote, and we're going to do about us. So now let's test out our movie. 
Okay, now we forgot one little thing because About Us popped up automatically. Let's go ahead and make sure this movie does not play instantly. Make sure we have nothing turned on. We're going to turn off autoplay. And let's test on our movie again. Let's do Command Return. So now if we go to About Us, we're now at the About Us section. And our Google button still works, as well as our Facebook button works. So once you've created the navigation for one button, you can duplicate that and just alter the text as well as altering the scripting for that. And you can get another button made really quickly.